Let's check if anyone else has any questions. Yeah, we've got a few more questions. Then let's go to the next one. Raise the hand. Black label expert. Okay, you're up. Black label expat, you are up. You're also muted. Hello, can you hear me now? Yes, hello. How's it going? Good, I've how been, are you uh, doing? Good, good. I've been keeping up on uh, your community and what you guys are doing, and it seems, seems pretty cool. But uh, I have a question about uh, the token, and I'm sure you guys are still working on it, it's still in you know development and whatnot. But uh, my question is that... Uh, what are you guys planning to do to, um, or what do you guys have on the whiteboard to incentivize investors to invest and to discourage uh, dumping of token? It's a good question. Um, in general, we're going to aim for a very fair and decentralized token launch across the board. Details are to come, obviously, but a lot of that has to do with trying to solve some of the problems of like you know confusion around tokenomics in general having different kinds of vesting and lock periods. Our goal is to really have a uh, very straightforward, transparent, and fair uh, discussion around tokenomics. And so that's why some of the details would take a while to figure out. But in general, that's our philosophy uh, to really create true decentralization throughout the network as well as its token. Okay. Yeah, we'll have to have, we'll, we'll hopefully have more details coming uh, as, as, as time progresses with the specifics, obviously. But just, just right, you know, right. that's our plan, yeah. And did you guys say like when or what quarter you guys were thinking about launching the token? Yeah, so the, the token will be launched together with mainnet in Q3. Q3, all right. Yeah. All right, that's it for me, thanks. Cool, thank you. Next up we have Pashkat. Hello. Hello, hello. Uh, I have uh, the question. Question number one. How can I test the network? Uh, in right what now. way? Uh, what kinds of tests you're having in mind? We have like multiple ways for you to test our network right now. Uh, for the first, you can try go through our tutorials, uh, try to submit a transactions, try to write a move contract, try to even create your first NFTs. So right now, DevNet is open for public to testing. So we have a faucet. You can even like uh, request some coins, do some like a uh, uh, write some code and try to interact with our network. And another way uh, which lots of people are doing right now is you can also try to run a full node to synchronize to a DevNet and see all the transactions happening on the DevNet, um, see all the versions and see the TPS, um, all the data happening on DevNet. So there's multiple ways you can already interact with DevNet. Uh, okay, uh, did I understand uh, correctly what uh, documentation has all the necessary information? Yes, uh, please visit our aptos.dev, uh, the website. So we have tutorials, documentations there. You can have like a, you, you can start from there. There's a getting started link. And that's where I would uh, begin. Yeah. Cool. Thank uh, you. Okay, Bush. and uh, okay, okay. Well, one question last. Uh, uh, can I make uh, instruction videos? Yes, uh, please do. Oh, okay, okay, nice. Thank you. Thank you. Cool. Uh, we have Paul Stina. Hello, welcome back. Hello, hello. Do you hear me? Yes. Cool, cool, great. Uh, uh, nice to hear you. Uh, Likewise. First of, all, uh, yeah. first of all, I would like uh, to thank the team that uh, what you create, and uh, I really, really like your idea. Uh, so, uh, I have been with you since 15 
Mars, uh, and uh, I monitor all the updates, all information uh, about the project in different uh, groups, uh, in Medium and website, in Discord also. And uh, I really touch uh, that uh, uh, team are very uh, active with the uh, community. Uh, also, I like it very... Um, also, I like it. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Yeah, we, we've been trying. It's, it's... It's been a lot, uh, but, but we really like being kind of the community as well. I think it is cool because uh, it, it uh, can be your main, uh, main power uh, between different uh, startups. And also, a couple of days, I talked with Greg on the topic that uh, there are many external guides on uh, launch and development and that. And, uh, and uh, uh, in a centralized test with uh, different links, uh, custom links so for developments. A uh, good example can be uh, not tested by, uh, produced by Jensen uh, Tank. Uh, and uh, uh, many users believe that. Uh, this was uh, the development uh, of the team. Uh, to tell the truth, and the, um, I also thought so um, in the past. Yeah, it's it's definitely a little bit confusing. Um, we definitely want anyone you know who uses Aptos or make a tutorial to make it clear that it's not an official tutorial. Um, we are also working, you know, like we will have our own demo example wallet to, to show people how to integrate with our libraries, um, how to do signing and things like that, like Web3.js version for Aptos. Um, so going forward, we do want to build some of these toolings out. Um, but you know, I, I highly recommend that you take a look. Um, you know, anyone who's unsure about whether or not it's something that Aptos made or not, um, there's only two domains that we're on, aptoslabs.com and aptos.dev. Uh, anything else is probably uh, from the community, unless we, you know, we add it to our uh, dev resources. I absolutely agree with you. We also mentioned uh, this, uh, this um, information. And uh, my um, also thank you that you are respons responsive for this so quickly. Uh, just uh, today we have information about this. And uh, uh, my next question, uh, or oh, maybe not question, I, I would like also um, that the team uh, think about the topic. Um, there are, um, all the um, uh, personal developments can leak uh, users to uh, data information or uh, attempts uh, to access to data or hack attack. I hope it uh, won't. How does comp how does the team uh, can react on this uh, or protect yourself? What do you think about this? Protect yourself from scams and outdated information? Um, from uh, yes, that's... Uh, um, uh, it's possible... Um, uh, can uh, provide to leak information, uh, private information, uh, personal information. Well, I think the easiest thing is we we don't have you know the, the private or personal information of any of our users. Um, you know we're planning on launching a decentralized network uh, for incentivized test nets. Uh, we're still working through you know what our legal requirements will be, um, and so you know we're we're not interested in in capturing personal information. Um, and, and so I think that the easiest way to defend against it for us is just we don't need it, and so we, we won't have it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I guess okay, uh, we keep suggesting all of our community members, please like, uh, try to disable your DMs from the server so that yeah. the scammers won't be able to send messages.